Hello and welcome back to Rob's Homemade Food and Recipes and today's recipe is steak onion and mushroom baguette with a side of onion rings. We'll start with one part of a baguette sliced in half, red onion, sliced mushrooms, parsley, one sirloin steak sliced thin, mustard mayonnaise and we will be using my steak seasoning available over at www.robshomemade.com uh, let's get cracking then this is a simple quick recipe not a problem at all for anyone my old faithful grill pan onto the stove drizzle of olive oil just to uh, get the steak because I like my steak cooked medium medium rareish I will be cooking the onions and mushrooms first onion rings already in the deep fryer cooking away nicely beautiful right let's grab the onions get them in uh, slice mushrooms as thinly or as fatly as you like straight in and we'll uh, fry these off. <coughs> I do like a bit of crunch to my uh, mushroom, so I will be only frying them for a few minutes. So we've got the onions and mushrooms cooking away. Beautiful onion rings. Once you've got the oil up to a decent temperature, two to three minutes. I do like tend to make my own onion rings, but I always keep a bag in the freezer. For times like this, when it's a quick snack, quick meal, and you want things done. So, onion rings pretty much done. Give them another 20 30 seconds. Back to the onion and mushrooms. Turn off the onion rings as them are ready. Drain off the excess oil. You take over to the dish. So I do that love my onion rings. I don't know about anybody else, but perfect a compliment to any burger, any steak sandwich, beautiful things. So let's grab the steak, which obviously is the main ingredient of this recipe. My steak seasoning. In previous videos, you've seen me marinate the fish, the Cajun, the chicken in the tip. With this steak seasoning, it's just a sprinkle over the steak. Quick turn. another sprinkle just you basically quickly coating the steak with the seasoning which is going to be fried with the steak with the onions and mushrooms back over to those coming along nicely beautiful charred mushrooms Right. Like I said earlier, I do like my steak medium, medium rare mostly when I'm having steak, but on a baguette because it's thin, thinly sliced. This will take no time at all to cook. Steak in the pan as well. This should be a quick stir fry. Also, whichever way you like the steak, some people do like their steak well done, which personally for me is not my thing. 
see, it's going to be a quick fry now. Just turn the gas back up now, the steak's in. Quick fry, and we're good to go. You want to add more steak seasoning? Just little sprinkling on the steak. Also, coating the mushrooms and the onions. You can smell the paprika, chili flakes. And the brown sugar, well, that's also in the steak seasoning, will help caramelise the steak beautifully. I do try and cook my mushrooms to a similar size every time so everything cooks evenly. Like I said, with me, my steak, medium rare. Personal preference, whatever you like, is a quick way of doing it. Smell the sizzle, all coming along beautifully. This, this, for me, this will be another probably 30 seconds, maybe a minute max. A bit more seasoning for me. Browning beautifully. Do like a little bit of red meat in there. Absolutely fantastic. And basically, for me, that would be done. For you or anybody who likes their meat, a bit more well done. Another couple of minutes. You don't want to dry the steak out because you end up with chewy, horrible meat. So, off the heat you go. As you can come in off the heat, literally, look at that, beautiful, beautiful, fantastic, just going to grab a bigger spoon, like I say, turn your gases off, don't forget that. And literally, all I'm going to do now, scoop steak. Onto the baguette. I've probably done an, enough here for two baguettes, but I do like it well filled. I mean, I wish you could smell this, but if you do try this recipe, you will not be disappointed, I promise you that. Mustard mayo. I've used this before on my Cajun rice fish balls and I love it. It's plain and simple, mayonnaise, English mustard, drop of parsley, it's fantastic. And there we have it, sprinkle of parsley just to finish off. And there we go, it's my steak onion and mushroom baguette with mustard mayonnaise and onion rings. Hope you all enjoyed this video. It's quick and simple and an easy snack for on a night or whatever you've got handy. Could you please give this video a big thumbs up? It would help me loads. Like, share, subscribe, any comments, anything you have to say, any ideas for videos you'd like me to do, drop them in the comments below and see you again soon thank you very much thanks for watching goodbye